Subscribe to Smartphone Tutorials by clicking on the subscribe button and do remember to click on the notification bell icon to get instant notifications. Hello awesome people, welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. Let's unlock all the power in the OnePlus 5T. Hello awesome people, welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. Let's begin the unboxing for the amazing OnePlus 5T. Hello awesome people, welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. My name is Kailash and let's go ahead and buy the Samsung Galaxy Note 8. All the iPhones, the Oppo F3 Plus, Samsung Galaxy C9 Pro, Samsung Galaxy S7. So 2017 has come to an end. We did a lot of things, we did a lot of reviews and it was exciting. But hey, the future always has brilliant plans and an exciting, exciting future is what we are looking forward to. Now, first of all, let me wish you guys a happy, happy new year. I really appreciate all the support you guys have provided to me. And I assure you that Smartphone Tutorials in 2018 is the channel you would love to watch every single day. But I'm going to promise you guys a 365 upload commitment. So I'm going to upload each and every single day, no matter what the condition is, no matter what, I will never miss out on an upload. At least I will try my best to do that. Now, today is the 1st of January 2018 and we have a lot of exciting announcements for you guys. First of all, let me start with the good news. Well, the contest, the previous giveaway contest for which the prize was my in-ear pro headset and one surprise package is officially over and the names and the results are up. So the first prize of the My In Ear Pro headset goes to Himanshu Agarwal from Bangalore. Congratulations, kudos. Please send me an email. I will share all the details of how I'm going to ship it to you within a week's time. Apart from that, the second prize is the Ant VR headset and that goes to Jay Asha from Mumbai. So both of you guys, thank you very much for all the support and if you're watching this right now, Congratulations and get in touch with me. I will share your prizes with you. Now, the second major announcement that we're gonna talk about today is a new giveaway contest. Now, we are gonna reach around 1500 subscribers right now. And starting today, we are kicking off with a new competition in which the prize would be a brand new Redmi 5A. In the first giveaway contest, a lot of you guys told me I should give away a phone. Well, here it is. Here's your chance to use or win a brand new smartphone from Smartphone Tutorials the Xiaomi Redmi 5A. Now, the way we're gonna do this is by the end of January, by the end of this particular month, the channel has to cross 4,000 subscribers. If the channel crosses 4,000 subscribers, I will be giving away this phone to one lucky winner. Now, 
there are other ways to enter the contest as well obviously you should be subscribed you have to or you may watch all my videos you can like them you can share them and apart from that you can follow us on facebook instagram or twitter which will increase your chances of winning this grand prize now talking about today's video guys well as you know from my previous videos the oneplus 5t has received the oreo beta and it's been around a day or two i've been using it so today's video is going to be a quick first impressions and initial impressions of how the update is how stable it is what features are working what features are not working and if you are on a stable rom should you be upgrading or not hello awesome people welcome to smartphone tutorials welcome to 2018 let's review the audio update or the beta audio update for the oneplus 5t let's go All right guys, so welcome to the video and today we're going to talk about Android Oreo as the first impressions, how the last 24 hours have been, how's the battery life, does the Star Wars theme work or not and should you upgrade to Android Oreo or not. Now this is going to be a relatively short video because this is the first beta and expect a lot of bugs, not many but at least a few bugs in this particular update. So let's go ahead and unlock the phone real quick. Now, right off the bat, you have a clue that the Star Wars theme is working on this phone. So, that's a Star Wars wallpaper. And uh, if we scroll down to the About section, here's the Android Oreo Easter egg. There you go. That's Oreo for you guys. So, apart from that, uh, this particular beta comes with a lot of Android Oreo goodies like picture in picture, better dose mode that means better battery life, smoother and silkier performance which was one of the major highlights when Google released the Android Oreo update. What is there in it for us if you ask? Well, if you look at the overall user interface, now I'm using a custom launcher here but then again it more or less looks the same. The reason I'm using a custom launcher is because I like Google now to the left instead of the OnePlus shelf and apart from that the quick setting styles that you see here seem to have changed the look and if you go to the settings menu now the audio settings menu is a bit different when it comes to the pure Android experience but then again OnePlus have somehow streamlined it for us and uh, the performance is relatively snappier and I've not seen a lot of features or any features missing for that so kudos to oneplus for including all the features in the very first beta as well the camera performance is stable everything else works perfectly fine the battery life is pretty pretty good the audio quality the video quality there were no lags and i did not experience any crashes or any force closures now one highlight about this particular rom is that without wiping data you can go ahead and upgrade to it directly you can definitely upgrade and if you have any force closures you can just uninstall reinstall that app and everything works just as expected now meanwhile um a cute little surprise that we have here is if we go to display and if we go to theme Star Wars is still there. Now I had enabled it uh, using the method which I mentioned in my yesterday's video on the stable Android Nougat ROM and surprisingly when I upgraded to Android Oreo and then when I did a factory reset, even after the reset, the Star Wars theme continues to work which is brilliant. So that's another goodie added there. Now apart from this, uh, one bug, let's talk bugs right now. Mm, where do we have it? Okay, there's YouTube for you. So let's play any random video for that matter. Okay, there you go. And so the way picture in picture is supposed to work is if I tap home, you see that flicker? Let's let's do that again. So that's one bug that I found, which is really strange. So the video is playing and there's a flicker. So ideally it should minimize and come anywhere on the screen all right, so the home button, long press, should give us split screen. There you go. There you go. So split screen is working. 
so that's one feature which doesn't have a bug now these were the major features of android oreo and specifically to this particular update now we're not going to talk about all the oreo features here because that's a given that once oneplus has given us that update all the features should be there now apart from this it is definitely a daily driver the whole idea behind making this video was to give you guys confidence that yes you can upgrade to it even if you use this phone for work or business you can definitely upgrade to it and you can rely on it because the battery life is good the performance is very snappy the camera works and everything is perfectly fine now if i missed out on any important information here please go ahead and mention that in the comment section and if you like the video guys like share and subscribe and don't forget today is the first of january so the giveaway for the xiaomi redmi 5a has begun i will ensure that one lucky winner gets the xiaomi redmi 5a once again thank you for your time goodbye